Welcome everybody. So for those who have just joined us, we are just about to start a Pokemon Online TCGO standard tournament for the first time ever. <sighs> okay, so we are going to have a look at the standings here. We've also got a tournament channel going on on our Discord server, so that's how we're communicating with one another as well as sometimes... <laughs> yeah, hashtag Yorkshire Tea by the way. That's... we're not not sponsored but <laughs> oh no um so yeah there are quite a few of us which is awesome we're using challenge for the pairings it looks like there is a buy i'm guessing there must be because there's 21 of us so there surely is somebody who is not in these pairings whoever that is sorry jack isn't there but let's check if jack's down here and if he is then um then you've got the bye, dude. Yep. I think. That pretty much confirms it. So, yep, absolutely, guys, if you can get started now. So, grab your partners. Add them on TCGO. Please do your match. We're doing best of one. So, if you can let me know your results or any of the other judges. And then what I can do is punch them in here. And hopefully this will work. Again, not used this software before. Hopefully it's working. Um, yeah, it's it's Swiss style tournament. I'm just gonna quickly check with the other judges that that's all working. Cool. And then what we'll do is we'll flick over to my screen in a minute and you will be able to see so who am I against aha there we go so I have had a friend request for my game which is excellent cool has everybody got their pairings Cool. So, um, how long is time? So we're just using the online format. So I believe it's 20 minutes online. Um, if there is a tie, there will be ties. Um, we can do that on the challenge. <laughs> we can do that on the challenge server. So that's fine. So I'm pretty sure everybody has their pairings so let's get going so this is my match as you can see um we're using we're doing standard decks so i am using my rallet executor deck yeah so hopefully everyone's sorted if anybody needs me who is playing please just say in the tournament channel on discord or in the twitch chat i am keeping an eye on both Oh yes, you can see my hand on Twitch. Well, you're gonna have to deal with it. Uh, if against, if I'm against you on Twitch, please minimise. Just please. Otherwise, I'll just have to try and be unpredictable. I guess. I mean, yeah. Um. Turned it off. Promise. Okay. Well, I'll just have to try and believe you. Um, if I win. If I win no games, then, you know, I mean, I, w I wasn't expecting much anyway, so. <gasps> so I got a mulligan. That's a bit rubbish. Have <laughs> fun. <laughs> you see you have some cards, yes. Um, I had to take a mulligan, that sucks. The second one is a little bit better. Um, yeah, I mean, that's better, isn't it? Let's go with that. So if you don't, if you're watching and you don't play a lot of Pokemon TCGO, it's really smooth. Most of the rulings are correct, although you do have to take a few of them with a little pinch of salt because they aren't always 100%. Um, 
generally it's going to be fine for the sake of a tournament, but pff, it'll be fine. So we're starting out with Akario <laughs> Metal Metal Tag Team. Dude, I don't even know what that does. Okay, Steel Fist, I see. So yeah, you're just charging up the energy, really. Okay. Oh, oh, Bishop. Oh, Laura's running goons. Is she? Oh my goodness. Anyway, I'm getting distracted. Aha, okay, so that is a bit of a better hand. It's much better than the Mulligan hand that I had, so I'm grateful for that. Um, but, 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 yeah, let's let's give you a charm and one energy. Shaman has a lovely retreat cost. Don't show me this again. Um, of zero, so that's great. Uh, but, 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 and then we're gonna do some magic. We're gonna super growth that grookey boy. Yeah, Blacky, yes please. Yep, I know what evolution does, but if in case you don't, in case you're new here, um, whenever a Pokemon evolves, its status conditions are removed, so that's pretty swish. But it does keep any damage that is assigned to it. So Super Growth's great, it's a free move, I didn't have to have the energy there, I'm just charging up for later. Fingers crossed. Steel isn't a bad matchup for me, but I don't really know many Steel decks, so it becomes unpredictable, which isn't great. So I just really need to keep an eye on what's going on. I've increased Rowlet Exigutor's HP a little bit by giving them a big charm, so they've got an extra 30, which helps me out a little bit. Uh, so, I'm assuming I won't need my Weakness Guard energy in this match. So we're gonna Voltage Beat for the extra energy that I need to give Exigutor Rowlet that three energy for their main attack. I'm going to netball, oh, for the memes, no, no, for a Sawaddle. Pop that on bench. And we're going to put the pressure on a little bit with a calming hurricane. That heals me some damage as well, which is quite nice. Oh, getting some compliments there, look at that. Here, we'll do, we'll do a love heart emoji. Mount Cornet. Ah, that's why I've never seen it before. It's a steel specific card. Oh, that's nasty. My discard pile, really? Oh man, discard all energy from your opponent's Pokemon. Well, unfortunately, Rillaboom can just keep churning the energy out of my deck and keep popping it back on. So luckily, because I had an energy in hand, it doesn't actually worry me too much. Um, I'm not gonna play a supporter again. I am just gonna keep putting the pressure on. 300 damage is hopefully quite an annoying number for most people to hit. I defeated a tag team, so I get three prize cards, which is pretty yummy. If you defeat any Pokemon, you get to take one prize card. If you defeat a GX, you get to take two. If you defeat a tag team GX, there are two Pokemon on a card, you get to take three prize cards, which is really tough when there's six prize cards in a game. I'm obviously running tag teams as well. It can be risky. It's kind of a risk versus reward situation. Oh wow, we already have a result. That is crazy. I'm just gonna, yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I know, Rillaboom is really horrid sometimes. The Steel deck, it's not, yeah, it's not really built. Oh, this, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how well built Steel is to deal with this sort of deck. Obviously, if I get paired against Fire, I'm just done. Fire's gonna do double damage to me, and then it's just, yeah, good, goodbye my hopes and dreams of ever winning. That's why I have the weakness guard energy in the deck, is that it just kind of helps along with that a little bit. 
So obviously consistently worried about Rowlet Executor, so just charge up anything else in the meantime. Shaman Prism Start is great for that sort of thing. Um, and then we'll just keep the pressure up by taking out some extra Pokemon. There we go. <laughs> okay, and we'll get some results popped in in a minute as well, because a couple of people's matches are already ending. I still can't believe that. It's a bit crazy. Um, I'm actually just going to keep charging. So I don't have to take two energy here. I can take one if I want, but I'm actually just going to keep charging up Shaman because I, th I just feel it in my bones that that is the right thing to do right now. Oh, wait a minute. Coming Hurricane. I didn't realise you had no other basics out. Um, yeah. Just keep the pressure on. Hope that some more basics come out. So obviously I didn't do the full damage because of the GX move that was used earlier in the game. Um, otherwise it would have been a one shot. Oh dear. Okay, so unfortunately one of our competitors has had a problem with their computer. Um... Yeah, I, I mean, I don't mind waiting either, so if people are happy to, then we'll just wait for that match to finish. In the meantime, we can have a natter about other pokemon -y things. That katana, I've not seen that before. What does it do? Divine Paper. Your opponent has exactly six prize card ring. Oh, that's a shame. So that's a really an early game ringer, isn't it? Hmm. I like the art too. It's nice. Uh... Yeah, th there's really no point in me doing much else. So Shaman, is it grass energy specifically? Basic, basic energy, so there's no point in me attaching that. So let's just carry on. And um, yeah, I keep, I, I just get that little heal every time. Oh, that's a really nice draw. That's a really unfortunate. Um, yeah. <sighs> I feel a bit bad. This is a bit of a runaway win for me. It's probably not going to happen again. I'm just going to, I'm just going to evolve that anyway because it's one of my favourite cards in this deck. <laughs> not everybody uses it. It just helps me take less damage from attacks, which I think is really valuable, but other people not so much. It really depends on your playstyle, but I enjoy it a lot. And there we go. Sadly, I didn't take any damage in the end. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> MVP my round boys there we go so that was my first game um i'm going to uh i'm gonna punch in some scores i suppose look <laughs> oh rude gosh okay yeah so don't worry about timings guys um if you yeah if you need a bit more time just go for it take as much time as you need when i when i get the pairings in you know uh, anyway let's quickly flick to challenge and we'll pop a few of oh no i'll pop a few of the um results in so let's test it let's test it on mine so if it gets messed up then like it's not a big deal so how do i actually pop in no don't what do I do? How do I do this? Oh, okay. That's... what? Huh. What does... match details? Ah, I see. Oh. Huh. Have I not started it? That's... that's funny. Yeah, we've all got time for a cheeky tea. Oh, start the tournaments. That's hilarious. Uh, start. There we go. Okay. Oh, look. Now it's started. That's smart, isn't it? Oh, we hadn't started it. No. <laughs> oh, so you can now use the pencil mark. Yes, it? yes. So, um, again, we'll report scores. Um, there we go. Oh, no. Just, yep. One zero. Submit. There we go. And then presumably if I do that for everybody, it should should be all good. So 
let's find out who else has given me their scores. Mm. Byron's running a new deck and he won with that, so well done. Let's give you the one. Oh, no, sorry, there we go. Uh, verify the winner. Byron, yep, submit. Awesome, okay. Uh, then, who else has given me their... <laughs> okay, bode back one, so let's go report scores. One, zero, submit. There we go. Um, cool. Oh, okay. Apparently, Bow Bag annihilated Topo, but hey. Sometimes you just don't have a good round. Right. Okay. So, Kane, you won your game. What's your username, buddy? Let's have a look further up. It'll be in this chat. Ah, Kamito. Cool. That's a win for Kane, I believe. Submit. There we go. Amazing. Uh, was there anybody else? We're still waiting on John Owens to start. That's fine. And yeah, okay, that's all of our results so far. So that's pretty fun. Oh, no, another one's just come in. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, Kyle won. Joe lost. Oh, my gosh. Oh, and Jono's game has started. Amazing news. So let's quickly pop this in. So, uh, Joe, you are Jack Fish. You're Jack Fish are real, aren't you? What meta deck are you playing today, Kyle? Wouldn't everyone like to know? Okay, uh, uh, quickly, yeah, Kyle won, so let's pop that in now. There we go. Good job, dude. Submit. Okay, and... No meta here. Oh, Kyle's just shared his deck list, I think. It's brave, dude. It's brave. Um... Yeah. <laughs> okay, cool. So, um, yeah, let's just have a quick look at people's usernames a sec. Just got to triple check them again. Yes, Joe is Jack Fisher's real. Did he say he won? It is five rounds according to challenge. So that's what we're doing. Aha. Oops, marks in progress. Oh. Anyway, yeah, uh, we had a win here and a loss here. Nice one. Ha ha ha. Lovely job. Cool. Yeah, so we're waiting on a few more matches. We've got one, two, three, four, five, 
Five matches left, that's not too bad actually. We can roll with that. So it says report until the tournament is complete. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Amazing. So, let's flick back, I guess, to my screen for a few minutes. And we'll wait for some stuff. So we've got some cool prizes coming out of my um, personal collection as well. I don't really play with certain types and cards, so I don't mind giving them away. We've got all sorts. Let's see. Let's have a nosy at my collection. Why not? Oh, have I got some packs? I could open some packs. Should we open some packs? Let's do that. Oh, my God. A fates collide. Go on. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> so this will be... I'll just punch in a few packs before each time we do this so that while we're waiting, we can just, you know, open... Oh, Aerodactyl. Fossils. Dun, dun, dun. Um, I don't have any more evolutions. Nah. Ten chests. No, oh, they're boring though, aren't they? Ultra Prism, Team Up. Oh, Team Up. We could get more Jirachis to give away. Go on, let's crack those. Wait, where are they? Back. There. I've only got five, it's unlikely. <laughs> Boop. Do a deck profile. Deck profile 101, eggs 101. I mean, it's a very simple deck. I could. It's not a bad idea. Oh, we got the Eevee's and all eggs. Mmm. Not bad. Pincer, with some grip and squeeze. And. I despair. Seriously? Two? In the same pack. It's called cool. getting ripped off, bud. Ugh. I think I might have just had a... Uh, nope, we haven't had any more results. Sadness. Right, we've got a Morgan. I've not had a reverse hollow Morgan before. That's new in my collection. We've got some fossilised memories, Kabutops. I mean, the Eevee Snorlax was cute, right? That, that'll... That'll do for today. Galvantula. It's, it's not bad. It's cute. I like the big electric spider. Moltres, pretty. Mark. Uh, open some heart gold souls over. You're trying to get energies from heart gold soul silver? Really? I don't have any. I guess I could buy some. I've got a few coins. I don't play online loads. I'm gonna open this. I don't even know why. Why have I got a Dragon's Exalted pack? Oh, this is an actual... Oh, right, I see. Yes. Cool. Uh, we got some Detective Pikachu packs. That muck bad. Yeah, I mean, it's got a weird ability. I've, I've never seen anyone use it. Uh, okay, we've got a few more. Um, we've got a win from the muck... Thumbs. Lovely job. Submit. There we go. And I think Ben just shot his... Yep, yeah, Ben shot his uh, score at me as well. So let's do that one. That was a win from Ben. Just. Laura giving him a run for his money. Cool. Submit. So, who are we waiting on now? Probably Jono. Yep, Matt. Always oh, the judges, isn't it? Guys! <laughs> I know Jono started late. It's not his fault. Matt has no excuse. Do we... Okay. Carl's asking if they can have Rillaboom promos <laughs> online. Sure can. I brought all the codes home. <laughs> so, um... If anybody wants League promos, why not? I literally have codes for pretty much every League promo that we've ever been 
kind of eligible for, which I think is uh, Lost Thunder onwards, all of the online league promos. If you can, if you want them, just say so. And when I fling your online pack over, I will also give you the code for some online league promos, because why not? If you want anything in particular, please say, like Kyle wants some booms. Um, if you want anything different, just say, and I'll see if I've got it. Yeah, everyone loves some promos, all of them. Okay, now, no, I ain't getting it out. It's in my car, I can't be bothered. <laughs> well, I'll just throw you guys some codes then, um, cause you all were eligible for them. So, oh, Altaria, how did you like the art on some of the old ones? They trade for packs online. Really? Do people really like them that much? Yeah, uh, it looks like everyone wants some codes. So at the end of this, we'll get everyone some codes as well. Why not? So we've got some online codes. Wow, that's pretty good. I didn't think people would like the online promos that much online. I have a lot of codes, so I guess I'll just ping them to you guys and you guys can put them to better use than just sat in my car in a box. Yeah. So we're just waiting on one more match. It did start late, so that's absolutely fair play. Um, trainers. Huh. I mean, you don't want to know how many Kiaways I've got, so. <laughs> no. Too many. Oh, I just got some goons. I think that is genuinely the first one I've got. I don't think I've got any goons other than that. Not key always. Yeah, I know no one wants them. That's why I've got loads. Oh, Animal Crossing in between rounds. That is a shout. I wish I could do that, but no. I haven't logged on Animal Crossing today, but yesterday I got really lucky. Was it yesterday? It might have been the day before, but I caught like four oarfish in the space of less than an hour. It was great. Let's just open up all this stuff. I got a lot of Cosmic Eclipse pre-release kits. I have more codes for more Cosmic Eclipse pre-release kits somewhere from the draft we did just before everything went a bit bananas. Uh, yeah, I've got Electro Powers, I've got Treasures, I've got Flints, so yeah, you guys. Wow, really? Oof, that's crazy. Ah, and Matt lost. Sadness. Okay, so let's flick back over to challenge for a minute. And let's have a look at how we do this. So, report scores. T -t 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 -t. Who even is who? I don't even know. Let's check. I think that's possibly the only thing I'll change in the future is I might put everybody's like discord name next to the oh right yeah no I've already popped his in yeah um I'll probably put everyone's real name next to maybe their username some of them aren't as obvious as others and Joe just likes to mess with us for confusion clearly <laughs> Jack Fisher real. Um, it's gonna be funny when you two get paired against each other because Jack is is down here in the actual pairings of it all. Is he? It's a triple check. Wait, what? Did I actually not put him in? No, that's crazy. Crazy talk. Twenty. Where's the one? Everyone saw it was there. Uh, we'll see what happens when we pair the next round. Hopefully, Jack should. Oh, I know you can't change your piece, your Pokemon TCGO names. It's not your fault, but yeah, I mean. It's fun for trolling purposes, Joe, so you'll just have to leave it like that forever. Ha ha. But yeah, presumably, 
there is I'm assuming it doesn't it can't yeah oh right yeah because it's rank and obviously we're the only ones that have started games it should add Jack Fisher in next which would be better gosh cool so yeah that shouldn't be too bad amazing so right I guess we'll go back to Pokemon for a minute we've got a bit of time to kill as we've got one more game to go not too shabby oh no I didn't mean to tap that for trade who's gonna want a burn I mean who knows you could have that is it burning shadows that has that silly Charizard in it go on <laughs> Azumarill, he's a fat boy with that thick fat, and Rhyperia with a toppling wind. That that survivor with the more poison was so good. Ugh, not standard legal anymore, but psh. should we look at some? I don't want to favorite that. No, that is the opposite of what I want to do. I want to open this to see what trash is in here. The only tournament where the TO gets to play, yeah, because it's not official, so I can actually play in my own tournament. Um, these weird four card packs are so strange online. Oh, uh, that looks basically identical to the last. I wasted my time putting these codes in. Matt Champ directing traffic. Like, none of these are realistically playable, I don't think. They're fun for the collection value, I suppose. Like, I've got a little collection of them, which is quite fun. But, you know, that's about it. Ah! Jono! Unfortunately lost. So let's let's head back to challenge and have a little look. So... Cool! Report stores. Scores. Stores. Scores. Those are the scores on the doors. Submit. So hopefully this will do a thing. And hopefully Jack... Yeah, he is in. Okay, that's absolutely brilliant. And... Brilliant! Okay, guys, that is the second round of pairings. Obviously someone will be left off there. I don't know who, but you know. Um... Cool. Just had a quick message about the tournament. It's okay. We're getting things sorted. Everything is fine. Um, yeah. So if everyone could have a little look at their pairings. Jack, you are back. You are in, my man. You can absolutely play now. <laughs> cool. So, um, yes. I Let's go on here. Okay, hopefully that is enough time for everyone. Uh, yeah, and yep, yeah, to those who have the buy, that is an automatic technical win. So you don't get the full points of a win, sadly. So in tiebreak situations, sadness. But yeah, essentially it counts as a win. So that's pretty nifty. So... I'm hoping everyone's seen that. If you haven't, tell me and we'll get it sorted. But for now, I'm just about to challenge my opponent here into our game. Hopefully this will go down without a hitch. There we go. It's happening. Okay, cool Dragonite coin. You clearly have been playing online longer than I have. I don't even know where you get that. It's like a Dragon's Majesty thing. Okay. Uh, 
so this is a pretty good starting hand for me. But again, I don't really know what I'm up against. So... Let's leave it at that for now. And hope and pray. Oh gosh! You better not be running Chinchino Mill. Please don't be running Chinchino Mill. Please. <laughs> I'm not a fan. I'm not 100% sure how to get around it. I've not really played this deck against a mill deck before. Although I run a mill deck, I run Centre Scorch, but we'll, we'll have to see. Okay. Right. I don't think there's an awful lot I can do right now other than just set up as best I can. Sorry if you can hear any background noise. Jack just walked past and just muttered to himself that his feet were sweaty. Thanks. <laughs> I just wasn't sure if people could hear that. <laughs> okay, I, I don't really know how to tackle this deck. Because damage isn't really a big thing that it does, obviously. Um, I suppose I just have to keep just setting up as normal. Which is really crazy. So, hey, I mean, I, yeah. <sighs> yeah. Looks like Ginchino Mill. This will be interesting. Lily's Pokédor is such a good card. Like, Secret Rare is so pretty. Okay, right, okay, that was the extra energy I needed, so that's pretty yummy. And then I guess... I, I just don't even know... I don't think it's even worth me playing the extra energy. I think that's just going to do me in a bit. So I suppose for now we just... We just hit the doll. Ugh. Why? Please don't be able to evolve that. Oh, resource management of Rangaroo, go away. No! What are you doing? Oh, I suppose, yeah, you, yeah. Okay, right. I suppose, yeah, trying to save the Minchinos for when they're actually needed. There's not a lot of point in me doing anything else other than just knocking out the sacrifice that he laid before me. Sacrifice the Aranguru to the roundest of boys. So I assume he's struggling to get the Chinchino. It's the only thing that really makes sense right now. Um, I hope everyone else's matches are going okay. I'm keeping an eye on the tournament channel, so yeah, if you need anything, just message me there or in the Twitch chat. I've got both of them to my side. But I, oh, I managed to sweep another of the Orangaroo. Am I just going to keep knocking out Orangaroo for a while? Because, I mean, I'm not mad at that, but... <laughs> It wasn't the game plan. I suppose I'm not really losing anything at the moment. If the intention is to mill me, he's not doing so yet. There's nothing in my discard pile, so that's good. I hope. It's 
So the Mancino with the air balloon is pretty good. It's ready, just the pivot that's coming in and out. Yeah, I suppose the Chinchino itself doesn't really do anything. Uh, here we go. Here's the beginning of the mill. Oh, your Mew 3 and a Discarpado. No, Shaman is in the lost zone. <sighs> Shaman got lost. That's not what it's all about. Well, you know what? I'm just going to keep knocking things out because this is going quite well for me so far. He seems to have got really bad draw. If I just keep putting the pressure on, I've got a good hand. So hopefully that will treat me well. Even if he marnies me, it should be okay for now. Ah, quick ball. Zation? No! It wasn't Mill. Or maybe it is. I don't know. But Zation is scary and I do not like it. No, no, no. Big nose from me. Nose across the board. Mm-hmm. Don't like him. Do not like him at all. So, let's think about things we can do to prepare against it. To be honest, again, I think there's not a whole lot I can... I'm going to put a big charm on Rillaboom. I'm just a bit worried about him. I don't know. I'm concerned about this situation. I don't know what's going on. So we're just going to... We're just going to put some pressure on. Two hits from coming Hurricane would be a knockout. So let's just keep the pressure on. Usually decks that run Zacian aren't going to heal because it's not really what the deck does. He can retreat. Air Balloon will get rid of that retreat cost. Chaotic Swell is a good idea at this point. So yeah, he's definitely picking up the pace now. Here's our first Chinchino. Here's that make do Chinchino. These were pre-release promos as well, which is stupidly crazy because they are awesome. So, and a Ditto Prism Star. Okay, so the pace is definitely picking up now. Oh dear. Let's see if I can turn the tie and just keep if I can just keep that one step ahead, I might be able to just keep going with this for a little bit. So let's just keep going. Let's just calming Hurricane that Zacian out of here. Because it's too scary. That is a lovely prize card. That is something that I would have searched for with a netball, but actually now I don't need to, which is brilliant. Uh, we've got our first match in again. Looks like someone had some really awful draws and another result in. I don't think our game's going to last past this turn. I don't think he can unfortunately bring it back from this because th I think it was just a really, really slow start, wasn't it? Oh, there's the there's the pre-release promo. How pretty is that? Oh, gorgeous. And Zacian V is so strong, especially when paired with Mew3. But yeah, mill yourself out on that one. I suppose, yeah, we can prolong the game. You might be able to knock me out if... Yeah, yeah, you might be able to win still, actually, if he manages to just keep something active that I have to two-shot, then that would do me in a little bit. But I do have the option of sticking loads of energy on Rowlet Executor and then getting rid of all of his energy. Currently, he's got no energy in play, so I think... I think I should be all right. Oh, now there's loads of Lily's polka dolls, which does not make me very happy. Um, uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, there is one way I can mitigate this. I might be able to... Okay, yeah, see, this is looking a little bit scary for me now because he's going to bring that polka doll forward and I need some way of getting something in his active spot that I can actually knock out. The results are pouring in now, so I will go through those in a minute. So if you guys can just hang fire, because I need to do some thinking. Because there is a lot of making do here. <laughs> God, this is really horrible. Um, yeah, I just need to kind of... Yeah, yeah, the wall of stuffed toys is terrifying. Stuffed toys and cuddly chinchinos with a doggo guarding them at the end. So, yeah, obviously the polka dolls are a bit rubbish for me. So we're going to netball 
and hope that Venusaur Snivy isn't in prizes, which it isn't. Here we go. Then we're going to bring that onto the bench. So let's check the ability. Once per turn, if it's an active Pokemon. Uh, yep, okay. So I should be able to do this. It's got a retreat cost of three. I hate that. But it's okay. We've got some switches in hand. So let's netball again for a grass energy. Okay. Now I've just got to do this in the correct order. So if we switch... this into play. Then we'll attach a grass type energy. We will switch something. I'll take that yummy chinchino right there. The one in the middle. Then we will um, Mallow and Lana to switch into Rowlet Executor again. Then we will Rillaboom Voltage Beat there's plenty of energy in my deck. That's awesome. Smack them both onto these boys here. Calming Hurricane that thing out of here. Goodbye, friend. I take my last prize card and I get my second win. See, guys, I do win online. Like, it's, yeah, this doesn't happen in person. Honestly, it doesn't. I don't get that lucky because those draws were hella bad. Those are so bad. I'm so sorry about that. You just didn't get the synergies there that you needed, really. So let's start popping in some results. So obviously I won again. Is it not rigged? I promise. There we go. And let's have a look at the others that I've been given. So. Where are our other results? Here we go. So we have Bode Bag 1. We've got a win there. Oh, no, that's not a thing. Uh, if I just click that, will it just... Oh, no, I do have to submit scores. Look at that. Okay, I was trying to be lazy, but clearly that's not how this is going to let me. Um, oh, Yep, that was right, okay. Um, Mighty Groove, we've got a win. Report those scores. Yep, sadly no, submit. We've got, yep, that's good. Okay, and Ben, we've got a win. Superb. Uh, Jono. Oh, sad. Lost. Yep, that's done. Jack Fisher. That was a win. Submit. We've got Kyle. Lost. Lovely. And I think, I think that's all our results so far. If it's not, can you please message and say? But I haven't done it yet because I think that means we should have three. Yeah. Three, oh wait, Ben. Ben gave me a result, didn't he? Or not? No, not yet. That's fine. We've got two Bens. It's always confusing. But hey, so we've got three more games ready to go. Or four. No, it's true. Yeah, four, sorry. 
Laura's still playing as well. That's no props. So, yeah, we'll just wait till those are done. We're doing well so far. I feel like it's going well. Again, sorry about the, uh, God, I feel so bad. That was like, that was, that was really unlucky. There was no way <laughs> this wasn't getting what you needed. And then you could see how fast that deck works when it gets going. That setup was so fast and almost terrifying from my perspective. So yeah. Oh, thanks, Duncan. <laughs> Duncan thinks it's going great. I hope so too. It's, you know, it is what it is. Oh, yes. Look how pretty that is. We can shove that into the prize pool too. So if anyone, you know, winners are getting stuff at the beginning, and if anyone else that I feel has done really well, psh, have some cards, have some codes and have some cards. So that is going straight in there. Yeah. Yeah, Venus or Snivy is really strong. Um, it did have me a pretty, pretty good win there. If, if I hadn't have had the Venus or Snivy, I probably would have gone down to that. It, I only run one in the deck. It might be worth running. Oh, uh, no, choo choo. Let's shove it in the prize pool. <laughs> Three mil players. Is there seriously three mil players? And we've got another result. Ben did a win. Ba -ba -ba ben did a win. Let's quickly pop that in. Yep, that's a win. Submit. There we go. Okay, so now we're waiting on three matches. Is that right? Cool. Ah, oh, and a full art Grimsley. Actually, I'm I might keep that. I might put that in one of my decks. Unless anyone particularly really wants it, like they, they can have it. Um Laura. Blah, blah, blah. Laura, did you Laura, are you done? There were a lot of messages just then. Let's quickly have a little look and just see. Oh, Laura is done. Okay, so let's flick back to challenge quickly. Let's leave that Grimsley there for a sec. So Laura, report scores. Sadly, she lost. There we go. Um, grumpy gills now, she says, oh, I'm sorry. And Bullinator one. Good job, Matt. There we go. And who are we waiting on? Okay, one last result. We are waiting on, which isn't so bad. So, and hopefully, it's a really awesome match. It is against Stoic thirteen and McPherson. So we are hopefully going to get that result very soon. Um, but there's no rush, so we'll get there eventually. <sighs> awesome. Amazing. So we're waiting on one more result. That's not so bad. So let's flick back to my screen for two seconds and let's open one more pack because this seems to be going very well. Three awesome cards in a row. I am not going to moan at that. Like, it, it, there's no way this can be another. There's no way. No, it wasn't. Here, here's the chain. It's gone. It's gone. The Scavalier. Sadly, not used in standard or possibly ever. Oh, Munchlax, snack search. That's what I wish I could do right now. We got a slow ducks. Oh, love it when Kareem used to run that deck. I wonder if he still does. I should ask him. It's such a silly deck. 
It's so much fun. And I don't know, with the amount of decks that run a lot of supporters, maybe it's still viable. I mean, why do I keep getting these double packs? That's two today and I've not opened a lot of packs. Two why nots with Peppy Pick. Rubbish. But we've got some really good pulls today, so actually I'm not going to moan at that too much. Oh, that's not a bad Dragon Knight. I never bought the theme deck for that, so I, I possibly don't have a lot of those, which is probably quite a good thing, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, who else have we got here? Crobat, which apparently, or maybe it's just, it's probably just the hollow I don't have. I must have that Crobat. I suppose it's in the rare slot though, so it's quite a common Crobat. They came in little packs in the supermarket in, yeah, I don't know. Triple Axel, yeah, I've heard a little didgeridoo that kind of Meganium deck. Oh, more bench you me, can't murder that. The Meganium deck with the um, Super Grow, Ripe, Ripeness Grow, I don't know. Uh, apparently that's pretty... I heard a little thing that it might be coming back a bit, so I've kept all my Meganiums, just in case, because again it works really well. So possibly with some of the newer stuff that's coming out in Rebel Clash, we might be able to see some. Oh, <laughs> hmm. Look at these guys that are never used. It's a shame. And the, the art. I feel like they could have done a better job with that. With that full art. It's it's not great. No. Why? Sad. And we've got our last result for that round. That's pretty exciting. So let's switch back to challenge. Let's get that popped in. Stoic one. Good job. In it goes. Submit. Amazing. Round three. Here we go. Ah, oh, against me next. Yeah, and John Jono does have a point. Just pointed out the alt art Marshallow match happens is amazing, and it is staring off into the sunset together. Slightly romantic. Yeah, it's really really nice. But the full art is just eh, disappointing. So, yeah, not not great. So let's send off that friend request. And yeah, Matt's just pointed out the old arts are always good. He's right seen the baby's altar. I'm very excited. I'm going to be I'm going to be excited to get hold of one of those. Aha. Okay. Hopefully everyone's seen the next round. Has everyone seen that? I'm going to pick my deck. I'll wait a few more minutes, well, a few more seconds for you guys. Don't want anyone not to see their pairing. Let's select my round boys deck. I'm ready. Okie dokie. Right. If anyone hasn't seen those, please again just message on the chat and I will put them back up. But for now, we're going to go back to this because I'm ready to accept my game. And I feel like I've got really lucky up until this point because just the people I've been against haven't had the best luck with their own deck. So I'm not holding out a lot of hope. Like my luck has to come to an end at some point here. Do people need the pairings back up? I see typing. Should we put them back up for two seconds? Let's put them back up for two seconds. Here we go, guys. Oh dear. They're apologizing in advance. What? Uh, some... Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've just... Ben, have you actually just won? Already? And yeah, so Kyle pointed out Grassbox has been doing well. Um, it has been 
Um, sorry. Um, this is my cat. <laughs> And she never leaves me alone. She's been asleep on Liz's bed. I put her to sleep before this started because I wasn't really want her being annoying. Stop it. Um, sweetie. Come on, sleep. Hey, look, sit down. Look, look. What should we play next? You ready? Okay. Left-handed play. <laughs> Are you gonna get off me now? Are you gonna stop being annoying? Good girl. Right. My hand is no short of awful, so we're gonna have to use a Marnie. <laughs> That's so frustrating. Oh gosh, this isn't getting any better. Okay, I think a couple of people are having trouble getting the pairings up. Are you? Oh my goodness. There's snacks behind there that someone's stealing. Yeah, you're gonna go the other way. Great. Um, so this could end up really badly for me. Um, I genuinely might lose almost immediately. I hope there was wasabi on that. Yeah, you shake your head, cat. Don't. You dare go and try and eat that sushi again. She's gonna. One sec. I will guard it in front of me. That's probably the worst idea. I'll put it somewhere in view. There. Uh, if anyone in my household is watching, if you could come and remove these snacks, that would be amazing. Oh, this match is going terribly for me. Like, I I don't have any other basics. Okay, another basic. We're saved. We're saved. What am I doing? Um, can you just remove those? Yeah. Thank you. Cool. Uh, <laughs> this is this is bad. This is real bad. Uh, let's start loading up shame in. We're gonna fury swipe that Mancino. Uh, oh dear, that was that was bad. Ten damage. Thank you, Matt, for helping out. Good girl, Perry. Good girl. Why is your ear sideways? It's because Steve took the stacks away. I'm sorry. I know. That's how I feel too when someone takes the snacks away. Yeah, so this is a pretty successful, this is very similar to the deck I just played, but they're not getting unlucky with the card draws, playing these gorgeous full art Cynthia Caitlin's, which is so unfair. Um, looks like we're having some trouble getting a couple of people started in the tournament, but Matt seems to be helping, which is brilliant. Thank you so much. Um, let's... Get that sorted. Hmm. Okay, so yeah, here comes the Chinchino making do. I finally got a workable hand, but obviously it's a uh... mm, bit touch and go now because. Where I've spent the last two turns really not being able to do much, it's already slowed my play down too much. Um, so I guess... Grookey's only got one retreat cost, so let's... No, let's not do that yet. Let's netball. Into Rowlet Executor, because that's really who we need right now. We need him to come save the day. Let's pop him on the bench. Come on, on the bench. And then let's pop a big charm on him too. Let's so yeah. Now now we'll retreat, Grookey. And 
Yeah, I guess, yeah, we'll, we'll pop an energy on and then we'll super growth. I feel like I've just got to try and catch up by just doing as much as I can towards, I, I should have set up long ago, this shouldn't be happening now, but I'm just gonna have to try and catch up as best I can. So yeah, it looks like a couple of the games, or possibly just one, is going to start late. Matt's possibly just because he's helping out. Um, guys, if you try sending a screenshot of what's happening to Matt, maybe, and see if he can help out that way. I don't really know if that's going to help too much. Um, I'm sure he'll get you sorted out in a sec, and then we can get that match on going. Hmm. Strange. Look at that hand, it's ridiculous. It's the mate, it's the, yeah, it's just the, the power of the chinchino right there. Hmm. Having username issues, it's never great. So, I'm actually just going to Cynthia here because I think A, I want all that energy in the deck realistically and I think I might get something a bit more useful out of here otherwise. Uh, it, that was not great. I'm not going to lie to any of you, that was not great. I really need the resource and I'm here. I can't believe I'm already technically running out of energy. Look at that, that is awful. Let's smack those both onto here. We need to start putting the pressure on really. I can hopefully Scare them a little bit. Let's just attach that to Shaman so that that's all charged up. If I can just keep the pressure on, I might be able to just out. I don't even know. I don't, I don't think I will, but without Venus or Snivy, this becomes increasingly difficult and my energy manipulation becomes really hard. So, yeah. So we've got a couple. Okay, seems like we've got a result in already, and I think that match that was going to start late has now started or is starting. So, good work, guys, and thank you to Matt helping out there. Awesome. I'm going to pop that result in now because I keep forgetting who won, so I will do that now because it's going to be so much easier for me. There we go. Score submitted. Cheers, guys. Okay, and let's see how much I'm being milled for this time. Bellerin. Bell, Bellerin, Bryson, man. Crushing Hammer, and there goes one of my energies. This is just, it's coming out all wrong for me and all right for them. That deck is nasty, man. Zation is just so powerful. And it just gives you all the resources and all the time you need using those chinchinos, the Lee's polka dolls and the Aranguru. Oh no. Consensus has another loss, that's no good. That's no good. Oh dear me. Again I'll sort that result in a mo. Let's watch the horrors unfold as, yep, they grabbed the Lily's polka dog back. I just can't, can't seem to win. So what we're going to do, we're going to have to possibly, okay, uh, right, we're going to Rillaboom one energy back onto the Rowlet Executor. I'm going to big charm shame in. We're going to put this on the bench just to thin my hands so we can blues tactics and then we'll take the knockout that we've been offered. I know they get the recycle energy back but like I just need every bit of help I can get. That's not a bad card. Cool. 
We've got another result. I'm going to pop that in quickly. There we go. Cool. And yeah, this is exactly how I expected this. Actually, how many cards do you have in deck? Three. So this is where the resource management are angry is supposed to come in, right? I can't mill those three cards, so I physically can't force them out. But I, if, if there's no way of them getting cards back into the deck, then I suppose... I might be able to win just through hanging on in there. Maybe. There is heal functionality to my deck to an extent, so I might be able to just hang in there through that. Oh, daring me. This is not looking good. So let's keep an eye. Yeah, so there's already four cards back in the deck now. Intrepid Sword. Like, I don't really know what's going on here, but, like, let's just set up. So, wait, they do have one card in the deck now. So, let, let's just keep playing as if I... I don't even know. Let's just keep playing. Let's just keep playing as if nothing is different, and I'm just going to keep doing what I would normally do. So, I don't have enough energy to do that. Let's just knock out the door and just see what's going to happen, because I'm so curious of what's going on right now. Well, like, I, he's going to draw that card. No cards in deck. So unless he manages to get something back down there, which he's going to have to, like, there's the Orangaroo is going to have to put some work in or something. I see. Oh, okay, that's clever. Yeah, so he's milled me. And obviously he doesn't mill anything. Yeah, and then things... Oh, this is clever! I've not seen the deck work this way before, but it does make the most sense. Yeah, there's possibly nothing I can do to catch up at this point. He's possibly... going to mill me to death. I can't forcibly mill that card. So, we're going to have to do something about it. So, what I'm going to need to do is, I actually don't know if I physically have enough energy in my deck for each viewer. So, I'd need at least another extra two energy for Solar Plant, and it would just heal everything. So, it's not going to put in much work. Um, I need to be able to do. I need to get rid of these dolls permanently. I need to switch things. And I need to be able to get my energy back. So let's boom and see how much energy I can get. One. So that's actually not going to help me very much because it means Venusaur's and Ivy cannot attack. Which is really super mega not helpful. I'm going to attach it anyway. I can switch into Venusaur Snivy, but I wouldn't be able to attack, but I could bring something forward and be really annoying. He's likely got air balloons. I'm not going to be able to attack him this turn. That's the really frustrating thing. I mean, Solar Plants can do 50 damage to each of his Pokemon. That would knock out both the dolls. I suppose it's annoying. Go on. Let's switch that. I love this. Yep. Bring forward that scary boy right there. And then let's just do a GX move. Yeah? I mean, it's going to be annoying at very least.
<laughs> oh yeah, this is terrifying. So <laughs> this match is not going well for me. <laughs> We've got some more results filtering in, which is brilliant. Um, yeah, we've had a restart on a match, but it's fine. It was due to connection issues, so it's not a big deal. I know you can come back from this, and that terrifies me in a sense. Get out. Stop milling me. How many cards have we got left? Yeah, 16. Okay. Mm, yep, that's... Yep. That's six more, so we're down to ten. And then I'll draw one on my turn, which will put it down to nine. Um, and yeah, this could go badly. If I can draw into an ordinary rod, that would be great, but it's very unlikely to happen. They might have all been discarded at this point. I, I'm scared to check. <laughs> Okay, we've got yeah, got some good wins coming in here. I think this is going to be a loss for me on this one. Can't see me coming back from this. Nightmare. It's so clever the way that people can just simmer on one to two cards in deck. I like would put me right on edge. I don't know if I could do it. I've seen it done at cups and stuff before, even like you know in top cuts easily. That Pidgeotto was. Can we not? It's a similar mechanic with the resource management of Grand Guru. And Chinchinos with the Make Do do a similar thing. It's just, yeah, it's just nasty, really. I think Matt's playing a Chandelier deck and he just won, so he, he seems pretty happy. Oh, dear God, please. No, 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 no. No. No more. Stop. Stop. And let's pray I have an energy. Okay, here we go. Come on, please. Something that's going to save me. That's... that's not going to save me. And yeah, I mean, let's just click it because we can. Let's just have a look what we got left in the deck. Yep, okay. Two of those cards would be useful. Um, but right now I can do absolutely nothing other than retreat. In which case, I guess I can hit the Zation. I. Yeah. Yeah. Go. You know what? Stuff it. I'm going to hit the Zation. Because I feel like it. Oh, I should have hit it with Shaman. And it's got free retreat cost. I'm just panicked. I'm panicked. It's going badly. The shaman was a much better choice. <laughs> oh, that was really daft. Oh well. Oh well. I have learnt today. Yeah, this is it. I think those are both of my useful cards I saw fly by. I don't think, I can't claw it back anyway, I have too many prize cards, and yeah, they've won. This is, this was pretty, this was pretty good. I'm, I'm pretty impressed. That was horrible. Thank you. There's not much I can do, I'm going to accept this loss, we're going to get rid of that doll. Yeah, well done. Well done. I am impressed. Yeah, absolutely. Well played indeed. That was awesome. <sighs> yeah. Phenomenal loss. I understand. I, I could detect better for that. I know I've definitely made some mistakes there, so I think if I came up against that in the future, I kind of know what I'm doing. Oh, really? Do you, it doesn't matter what I do. Like, let's just get rid of those, I guess. There, bye. Like, I can't draw a card now. There we go.
My turn begins. And defeat. Just goes to show it's not all about the damage. Wow. So let's go back and let's get some of those results punched in. So including mine, let's start with that. Good job. That was that was a good game. I enjoyed playing that. And next time I'll maybe know what I'm doing. We can try. <laughs> Mill is the no fun police. <laughs> no, I enjoyed that game. I did. No, I did enjoy it. I think that it's it's tough going against Mill because it's not been very prevalent in a lot of Pokemon decks in the past. But it's definitely something that is possible and it's definitely fun. I had fun too. So that was good. Let's do some more results. Who else had a go? Uh, Laura won. That's better. That's the result we like to see, Laura. Who did you win against? Who are you against? Topo. Hey. Well done, Laura. Good job. Pop yours win. Sorry, Topo. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Okay. That's Laura done. Um... I mean, Josh, you can forfeit your final two games. I think I can drop you, in which case there would be no bye. But it's totally up to you if you just want to play and have fun. Clearly, there are some people playing some silly decks because Matt's playing a silly deck. This was his first win. You mean Kyle? Okay, sure. Nice. Okay. So... Good job there. John I won. So we've got a result there too. Oh, keep going the wrong way. There we go. Then you're not using your own computer, look. Okay, cool. Anyone else? Was there anyone else? No? Okay, I think that was everyone so far. I think. Is there anyone else who I haven't reported their... Oh, Ben, yeah. Ben Shabba. Did you actually win? You actually won. What happened? Can I ask? Can you tell? Oh, and King. Lovely. Where are we? Where am I? There. Uh, bad luck, Byron. There we go. Oh, Donk Doc deck happened. I see. Oh. Oh dear. Ben donked a zebra and won. That's a shame. It happens though. I suppose, you know, it's one of the flaws of the game, I suppose, you could argue. And yeah, Matt, Matt's just said that he has better luck with the lamp deck on online than in real life. And I kind of have the same with with my grass deck. I, I find that I'm not... Maybe I just don't concentrate as much in person, I don't know. But I do find that I don't do as well. Uh, it'll probably be the Zeb Striker he's talking about, but did you get it to a Zeb Striker or was it... Or was it still the basic? Do you literally just knock out a basic and that was it? Wow. Gosh, small zebra. Oh dear. Well, so we are waiting on two more, two more games. It's not bad. And one of them is the one that started late. Um, for it because of a few username issues because this username is huge and apparently it wouldn't add because it was one digit too large but we seem to have managed to get that sorted um yeah 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 Keynes just said the pressure of an, an opponent actually sitting in front of you isn't there 
that's correct. Um, what even is a donk? I think it was just means that you knocked it out. I don't know. I've not heard that time before. Maybe that's just me, but yeah, just a, a little, yeah. Oh, Jack, Jack Fisher won. Hey, so that's another report here going on. Um, then we've, yeah, we've literally just got the one game that's died a little bit late to go, which is absolutely fair play. Um, check one, but he's forgotten how to type. <laughs> okay, well, we've got that result now, so that's all sorted. So we've only got two left to go. And then we're done. So, uh, yeah, let me know when your game ends, guys, and we'll get that sorted. I will be back in just two seconds, but I do have to run off for a moment, so I will be right back. I'll leave you on that screen for a tick. Okay, and we're back. So, how have we got a result? Not yet. You're still playing, Duncan? <laughs> Whew. Yeah, still playing. That's all right. Well, guess we'll switch back to some Pokemon trading card game online for a few minutes. We'll open this evolutions pack. This fun, fun evolutions pack. Oh dear. Oh. Riveting. I'm almost through all my packs. Almost. Oh, look a whistle. Why have I never seen that card? <laughs> Why? I mean, like, it look as relevant now with Marnie, I suppose, but like, in the, the two card combo, Lieutenant Surge is really the only way to make use of it properly, and then you're just redrawing things that you discarded. Is it worth it? Probably not. Using up space in the deck. It's a very strange card. It's true. Jono, Jono's just said I, I should open the chests. So they're locked. I do gain nothing from having, having them. Oh! Thanks, Jono. Yeah, I should open that! 
<laughs> that was that was a good one. I like that. Oh, look at look a theme deck tournament. That is an awful suggestion. Let's do it. <laughs> right, we'll open this chest. Twenty five coins. And a Rhyferia, and then we'll, we'll we'll get going, because there is another... There, oh, wrong thing. No. There we go. So we've got our last... Our last result here. Um, so yeah, someone's saying theme deck tournament would be hilarious. We did do one as a test. Matt ran it, and apparently it went really well. So I reckon we should do a theme deck tournament. So what I'd like to be able to do is do tournaments on a... Um, on a Monday and a Wednesday. So a Wednesday at 3 p.m. just because we've unfortunately already got things going on dice cup wise on a Friday, which was my other proposed day. So yeah. Carl's saying please no theme decks. You don't have to join in. <laughs> you do not have to join in. Um but hey, I mean yeah. Oh yeah. Pack opening is super fun. I'll, I'll, I'll upload some more packs before next time and we'll get some more done. Uh, those are the pairings, guys, for round four. We've got one more. They are janky. The theme decks are janky, but they are also fun. I I just feel like it's fun. I, I, it's, it's only for the funsies. We can do it. Why not? I don't even have many play, like theme decks. I probably have to like grab a new one, but, you know. It's all in the spirit of things. All in the spirit of things. Right, there we go. Yeah, it does depend heavily on the deck as well, someone's just said in the chat. Um, but, and yeah, so Wednesday is essentially what I want to do, hopefully, is some mixed tournaments. So we'll probably put it in the Facebook group and the Discord um, each week of what we fancy doing. We'll do things like expanded, we'll do theme decks, we'll do jank decks, we'll do all sorts. Um, if we do jank, I feel like we're going to have to have the deck lists in advance to the day of the tournament because otherwise we won't be able to have a judge have a quick look at it because if we're going to be playing jank, we kind of need it to be judge approved jank because someone could just... I don't know, bring, bring something not quite janky enough. Uh, a jank list is just something that's not in the meta, really. Obviously, there's certain decks that kind of teeter, and it's a bit hard to know exactly what would constitute as a full janky list, but essentially just something that's not going to be almost guaranteed wins for the competition is, is not what we want. A nice bit of fun jank is just something that... Uh, it's just a bit silly, really, rather than something that's gonna do well, like, you know, ADP and goons. Jank is spice. Jank, jank is the spiciest spice, as we're saying in the Twitch chat right now. So my game's about to start. I'm assuming everyone else has found their opponents. Oh, apologies. I didn't accept my challenge fast enough. Um, that was only because I was checking that everyone had got their pairings. Feel free to resend that. Sorry. Um... Right, yeah, so let's get back to this then. So hopefully everyone's found out, everyone's found their opponents. I will get that sorted as well. I'll send you a, a challenge, dude. <laughs> there we go, there we go. Um, but yeah. Cool, let's get going. Oh, that's a lot of different types in a deck. What is going on? Oh, I get the coin flip with my cute Rowlet coin. I lost the coin flip. That sucks. So now I'm going first. Oh no, you're going first. Okay. Oh gosh, that's, that's a hand. That's, that's a hand. Is this an ADP deck by any chance? With those lovely sleeves. Oh gosh, it's whimsy. No! Porygon Z Whimsicott can get out of here. Okay, right, we need to pick up the pace. So. 
Oh dear. Um, so essentially, I don't want to use the professor's research I've got in hand because I don't want it to discard the Marlow and Lana, knowing that I've only got one in the deck and I'd rather preserve that. So we're going to use Marnie. It pops it at the bottom, but at least it's there and the deck will get shuffled throughout the game. Um, oh dear. <laughs> Maybe they had a, a bad hand because I've shuffled it in for them. Uh, this is going to be bad. I can just feel it in my bones. Um, and we're going to give Shaman an energy because he deserves it for being such a good lad. This Shaman Prism Star puts in some work in this deck. It's got a free retreat cost and Flower and Storm not only takes your energy into account but also your opponents. Unfortunately, it's unlikely that deck is going to run any basic energy. So Shaman gets a bit debuffed by that. You'll see that most of it will be unit energy like this where he's using the Zacian as well. Okie dokie. Let's see how this goes. Um, yeah. Whimsicott is just... Oh my goodness, Matt has lost already. That's his brick for the day. He was running the Chandelure deck, which is really funny and really good. And it's looking to get even better in the next set, but God, it is. Yeah. Oh wow, and Laura's won her game as well. Wow, those are some really quick games. And here I am getting coin flipped by a whimsicott, no doubt. So let's quickly punch the um, results in before I forget, because I know what I'm like. It's Laura as a win and Matt as a loss. Okay, it is my turn. Yeah. Okay. Mm, this is not what I wanted. I actually don't think I can do anything on this turn, which sucks. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pass the turn, that's horrendous. That's probably one of the worst turns I've had with this deck in a very long time. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, this is bad. This is real bad. And the Zeb Strike is set up now with Sprint. It's a really good ability. Once during your turn, you can just discard your hand and draw four. And here we go with the crazy code Porygon Z. You can attach as many special energy as he likes from his hand. So that uh, makes Mimsicott incredibly powerful. And now, yeah, he's got no hand to discard, but gets to draw the seven. Hopefully there's more energy in there for him to keep attaching to that Whimsicott, which buffs energy blow. It's attack for one fairy energy, which the unit energy provides. Oh dear. Goodbye, Sir Waddle. R.I.P. my friend. Uh, yeah, we'll bring forward Shaman. He's got free retreat cost, so it's always a good one to pop out just if you're unsure. So yeah, Flower Storm's only gonna do 60 damage, which is no good. Have any of his Pokemon got a really infuriating retreat cost? No. That's rubbish. <laughs> um, it's got Stealthy Hood abilities, prevent all effects, okay. Um, right, yeah, so this isn't good. This is not looking good. So, yeah, so, oh, it's basically going to get attached to all of my Pokemon, but there's still going to be 60, which just isn't good enough. So, we're going to retreat into Venusaur Snivy. Attach an energy to it to activate its ability, which I will activate. I can't choose Porygon Z, I believe, because of the stealthy hood. Um, we're going to bring that Zacian forward. I'm here, buddy. Uh, pop another sword on bench for a bit of safety, a safety net, I suppose. And then we're done because I really cannot. I 
cannot seem to win <laughs> with this hand. Uh, we've got another result, so I'll pop that in. Mighty Groove won. Let's pop that in. There we go. And we're still going. Okay. So I do seem to have managed to stall out a little bit. Just by doing that. Gosh. But still no joy with my actual hand. We're going to have to pass again. This is not going well, but I do have another result. So Jack Fisher just won. Well done him. Let's pop that in. Um, there we go. Get the hang of this level. Get the hang of this. All good. So yeah. This match doesn't look like it's going to go very well for me, but let's see what we can do. Okey-dokey. Two Chinchino, ch yeah, there's two Chinchino Mill and one Centre Scotch Mill in this tournament. I play the Centre Scotch Mill personally. I don't actually think it's as good a deck, I'm not gonna lie. I do think the Chinchino Mill is better, but I, I'm a sucker for a bit of jank. And the Centre Scotch just kind of sits in that nice little semi-janky spot and I just can't resist it. So, um, yeah, that. That just makes my little heart pit a passer and I can't resist it, so I just have to have it. So I run the not as good mill, in my opinion. Again, it's my opinion. Center Scotch might get better. Um in time with the new set and stuff. But yeah, like th this game is going terribly. I literally can't do anything. Yeah, Laura's just said Sense Scotch worked well against her. It was mean. It is mean. Don't get me wrong, it's mean. But sometimes, especially like when we play in person, obviously we've got a couple of water players that come along to our league sessions. And just having that one shot on the Sense Scotch itself is just nasty. Yeah. Lapras V Max with Electro GX count as jank. I think it would count as jank. Realistically, that's not a deck that's used in the meta. It sounds daft. Electro GX is why. So yeah, I think Electro GX and Lapras VMAX, I'm happy to count that as jank. Jank approved. So yeah, that was Mina Source and Ivy getting knocked out. That was inevitable. So we're just gonna have to put a sacrifice forward. So Wall, sorry dude, you are sacrifice of the day. Uh, yeah, for Forbidden Light is in standard, so yeah, that's the last set, like the the set before things went out. So it's the one that kind of got saved out of that bunch. This is going so badly. Um, oh, Guardians Rising. Guardians Rising is not in rotation, um, but Energy Recycler has been since reprinted, so I believe it's still it's still in rotation as far as standard play goes. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, we've got some more. We've got some more results. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Uh, Joe won. I'm quickly going to put that in while I think about my turn, because I genuinely don't know what to do next, because it's a bit of a disaster. Um, Chaotic Swell will eat my life forest, can't play that. Ordinary Rod, I don't think there's anything worthy in discard pile, and to be honest, I can't pluck it out even if I did get it. So I think my best bet is just to essentially lose this game. <sighs> yeah, that's really upsetting. <laughs> 
Oh man, yeah, that is a loss. Uh, yeah, that was awful on my part. I am, wow, that was bad. Like, wow. GG dude, but Whimsicott is mean. Oh, Whimsicott. This is why I don't trade my Whimsicots though. Like I've got quite a few of them and I don't want to trade them. They're so good. Well, yeah, that, that was awful. So let's, let's go back to challenge and let's pop a few more results in because we've got a few more. Yeah. Yeah, Whimsicott is, is just, gah. So bad. <laughs> like, I just, it was, ugh. So frustrating. Let's just give myself, like, a million bad points for that. Like, no. Oh, I didn't actually manage. <laughs> they actually mean to go that far. Um, good job, Alex. Yeah, that was, um, gosh darn it. <laughs> oh, Byron, no. No. Byron lost sadness. There we go, that's another score. It's right there. Oh, John O won. Yes. Yeah, Whim Whimsicott's great. It's been great for a long time. It's just not a lot of people picked it up when it first came out. Like it even the cards now, like they are not expensive. Obviously you're running the Zacian in it. I've seen it with and without depends who you're up against really but yeah the the whimsicott is still like a three poundish card isn't it it's mad like realistically on the meta side of things it's a cheap ish deck to build if you're not wanting to spend a ridiculous amount of money yeah alex are all of theirs for less than a tenner it's yeah that is about right Absolutely crazy. But yeah, if you were going to play a jank deck in the next tournament, what sort of thing would you fancy playing? Like, does my babies count as jank? I would hope it does. It's not good enough to win things. So, <laughs> not unless you just get really, really kind of lucky. I don't know. I, I've recently put some Delcati in it, the Delcati from, um, Babies is not too jank, Matt. It's great. Matt thinks Babies is too jank. I disagree. Oh, Kyle just won. But yeah, like, I, I think it's, it's not great with con a consistent, on a consistency level, but I've recently put the Celestial Storm Delcati in and it has made it more consistent because you grab two supporters out of discard and pop them into your hand when you evolve it from a skitty. Which I actually didn't know about it. I bought the card by accident almost because I won it on an eBay bid when I was actually just going for a Rillaboom. Um, but it was paired, they were both pre-release promos and it was paired with the Delcati. So it was, uh, yeah, it was an interesting, interesting, Hard. I do not have babies built online, uh, Matt, but I should build it online. Yeah. Hat ladies and mega tita. Not tried that, but I've seen it. I'm certain I've seen someone do that, like play that deck against me. Cataday is fun jank. I built my friend a Cataday deck. That that was yeah. He doesn't play much anymore, but like, ah. Oh. Cataday in its prime before rotation. Ah, so good. Yeah, I, I will I will I will build I will build babies online and we'll give that a test and maybe I'll I'll build it online, we'll play it in the jank tournament. We'll do that. Okay, so I believe did I have a did I have a result there? Yes I did. There we go. 
we've got one more there. And we'll make you one game. That was quick. So stoic again, and again, we know that that is a, yeah, we know that that is a, um, we know that's a mill deck, so that could take a while if uh, Ben is managing to, to manage that well. I'll be interested to see what the result from this game is. Yeah, it's mill, Ben's confirming. <laughs> so that's scary. Oh, is it mill mirror? Are you both playing mill? Ben! What are you doing? Oh, Ben's got him down to two prizes, but but looks like he's gonna win it. I don't think Ben's coming out of this well. Well, while we're waiting, just for two seconds, we'll open another chest. I don't think it's gonna... Oh, Ben says, I'm not playing Mill. I have self-respect, so... <laughs> I can't talk, I have a mill deck, but... Oh, th these are sad chests, these aren't good. The chests from before this game were much better. Shady shady. You shady lady Wobbuffet, it's not a lady Wobbuffet, it would have lipstick. <sighs> okay. Noctowl. I'm a sucker for a bit of Gen 2, so can't moan about that. Can't moan about that. Ingo and Emmett. Awful. And Ben unfortunately lost. So let's punch that in in a second. Let's open one more chest. Get a trash mon. Oh. Oh. Kangas Khan. Oh, it's got Choo Choo in the background. We can appreciate that. There we go. Right. Let's flick back to challenge and let's pop that result in Stoic's doing very well. Ben, it looks like you put up a better fight than I did though, mate. So well done, because I did not do well against that deck at all. So round five, this is the last round. Let's have a looky. Oh, I get to play against that Chandelier deck we were talking about. <laughs> oh man, wow. Wow. Okay, guys. So Chandler is not a good matchup for me at all because obviously I play grass and it is a fire deck so unless I get quite lucky it's gonna do double damage which is gonna be horrible so whoo yeah so Matt's gonna pause the stream or at least stop looking at it so that he doesn't you know see when I've got that that nice uh, hand hopefully against him show him minus one on the record Huh, okay, one sec, there might be a... Challenges pre treating a buy as a tie. Okay, I might be able to change that. Um, again, sorry about that, one second. Will it let me edit it? If not, what we can do is we can change the scores at the end, I'm sure. We can change the match scores. Um, although I suppose that doesn't really help for the sake of... Yeah. That doesn't really help for the sake of pairings, but I suppose it can't really happen. We can't really do much about that now. Yeah, that should be treating it as uh, the buys as a win. Um, no, that's not great. So let's have a quick look at what we can do about that. So everyone just hold your horses just a second. I'm not sure if there's anything we're going to be able to do about it right now, but we can look at the scores in the end and we can have a look about what we might be able to do about that because we can essentially manually add some match points onto those who had buys and then it will 
although we might not get the exact mathematics of it, we should be able to edit the score, if you know what I mean, because obviously a win is three points and a, a tie is one. So we might be able to just kind of manually edit those at the end. So if we just carry on, I think it's probably going to be for the best because we don't really have much. I physically don't think I can change it right now. Matt, do you have any suggestions? I'll quickly type because I think he might have turned. Um... Oh, he, he seems to be typing. Okay, and I seem to have given someone minus one points by accident. Have I done that? Oh, let's go back to round. Um. Oh, I did. <laughs> okay, that's 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 where we've got a problem. Is there as well? So let's submit. Okay. There we go. Okay. So yeah, it, it, we'll have a look at when the standings, if everyone could just carry on their matches, we'll have a little look and we will check it at the end. Anyone that is in the top, we will check your match score. If you had a buy at any point, we will treat it as if it's worth more points than it was. And at the end of the day, this is our first tournament. I'll fiddle around with the settings for next time. We will figure it out and don't worry about it too much because if anyone ends up on confused match scores of any kind then obviously we're going to edit those in our minds and we will give prizing to the top two or three anyway so don't worry about it too much for now if it doesn't look like we're able to change it sounds like steve might be coming down to have a little look with me although are you We're full short of 50. We've got like 20 on people watching. Oh shit. Oh, well done. Um, yeah, so um, obviously as well, if you want to catch the next ones, then please um, do follow the Twitch really channel. Okay. We really appreciate the support. Obviously, we're doing it for the Dice Cup Cafe as well, and they could really do with it. We could really do with it. Um, but yeah, I hope everyone's having fun anyway. Let's carry on. Let's get these matches done. And we will sort those match scores out in a bit. For now, let's let's... Let's roll with it. Okay. We'll get that fixed in a bit. Because I think it's just going to be easier if we sort that later. Um, we might be able to get it to sort it in the settings at the end. I don't know how challenge works 100%. So we'll figure it out in a bit. If it won't manually do it, then obviously we will just treat it as if the scores are different. We'll check who had the buys and we'll change their map scores accordingly. Um, wonderful, I won the flip. That's awesome. No, I would not like to go first. Silly thing. Aha! Yeah, I suppose that's the something. I'm assuming Matt's gonna mulligan a fair bit. I don't know. Because, um, oh, I just misclicked. <laughs> oh well, life goes on. I'll fix it. It's fine. Because his deck has not, so yeah, as you can see here, there's a lot of evolved Pokemon in here because his deck revolves around being able to play them straight on the bench without having to evolve them from anything. Uh-huh, and we're starting with the Jirachi, which is not great, but it's also not bad. Stellar Wish is a brilliant ability, so, wow. We've got a couple of those Jirachi in the in the online prize pool as well. I've got two of them to give away, so oh, very very good. <laughs> oh, yeah, this deck is crazy, and it seems to have been doing well across the across the pond in Japan. This deck seems to be doing well. Obviously, they are a set ahead of us, essentially. Um, they seem to be doing really well with it, so that's pretty scary. There we go. Okay. 
corrected our little mistake there. Um, let me think. So he is going to be relying on having lots of energy. So we could either go for Shaman or we could go for Delmise. I think the Delmise is just going to take the cake just for the minute. I'm not sure which one's actually going to be. Wow. Yeah, I don't know which one's actually going to be more useful in this pair up. I haven't played this deck in a while, like against the Chandelier deck. And I don't I don't think I've played it since the V cards came out, so I'm not sure how well Delmise kind of counters it. Hmm. Yeah. So Carl's just said that he got 26 packs for a Jirachi this morning, so yeah, they're creeping up again. Uh, it's probably about right for the amount of team up packs that I opened, two is probably about it. I, th I had three but I traded one away. Um, so yeah, I, probably for about the amount of packs that I, um, that I opened, that sounds about the right amount of Pokemon. Okay, so we only got one blaze can out of that, which is not bad for me. Although 140 damage is not fun. I no. Big no. So I guess, yeah, so I, I can knock out that Chandler this turn, so that's fine. So we'll do that. Cause I do not want him to get ahead in this really. Yeah, that's the thing, I'm taking single prizes at a time as well, so it's really, really gonna elongate this game, but if Matt can't get under the chandelier out and about fast, then I'm just gonna wipe the floor with him. If he can find another chandelier fast, then that's that. But only getting the Blaziken from the Spirit Burner, that's not great. He said in the chat he thinks he's losing already. Um, yeah, I've got a pretty good hand as well. I've got my Ordinary Rod. If he does manage to knock out my Rallet Executor, I can get the energy back in the deck and then I can Rillaboom it back. I've got a Weakness Guard energy ready now that I've drawn into, so I can attach that to take less damage from his Fire types, which I'm actually going to do because I'm just that little bit concerned. Um, I'm going to Rillaboom. I'm going to Voltage Beat as well, because I'm just going to get all set up with Delmise as well. And then we're just kind of ready for anything that might come our way. Knock out one Jirachi. Take one prize. Paul just won his game, so that was fast. Well done. Let's see if Pat gets anything with the Stellar Wish. So yeah, this Blaziken's pretty neat. You can attach a Fire Energy from your discard when you're benched each turn. Ah, Secret Rare Giant Heart. That is fancy. Woo! I do like how they've managed to get the texture on the online cards because I know that essentially when they 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 essentially used to just scan them in. Um. I assume they use just the official art for the card instead now and just upload it. But you, sometimes it used to look like they had been sort of poorly scanned in, which was kind of upsetting. Um, but that's really pretty. So yeah, Fire Stream is annoying, but doesn't knock me out. Thank goodness. My Weakness Guard energy coming in really handy there. So we're going to bump up Delmise to 3 energy because it deserves it. We're going to netball because I would like the Venusaur Snivy just out of pure concern of being able to switch out his bench. Big Charm Rally Executor, I do not want it getting knocked out. And then we will take Blaziken out and heal a little bit in the process. Pops me back down to 140 damage, which is better. Oh yeah, look at that. You see the little Rowlet? There he is. 
on the on the executable side. I love that art so much. It's just so quirky and so cute. This art don't like it so much. The Rowlet looks like it looks flat. I don't know. I just don't like it that much. The Rowlet could look so much better, and I love Rowlet so. That sucks a little. On this one, the Rowlet's really tiny. He is much cuter, so I appreciate that. But then you can barely see him. And it just kind of looks like Executor. So, I don't know. I've got a lot of love for the full art. I suppose is what I'm saying. <sighs> ah, here we go. Litwick and Chandelier. Popping those back in the deck with an ordinary rod. Not sure if Matt can catch up at this point. Hopefully not. <laughs> I'm quickly going to pop Paul's result in before I forget. There we go. Ben has also done a win, he says. There we go. And let's check back in here. So we've got an Orangaroo down now. Yeah. yeah. Primate Wisdom. Mmm, great catcher, hello. Oh dear. Looks like Topo lost. Let's pop that in. Okay. I guess I'll just start charging up the Venus or Snivy, there's no harm. I'm a bit concerned he's gonna great catch me at some point, but I wouldn't know what for. But if I put one energy on it now, then I'm kind of just covering my back a bit because I can get two on with Rillaboom, attach one for a turn. I can get up to that four for a forest to dump. Um, oh, and there's all three of my executor rowlets. <laughs> Brilliant. And Jono one. Yeah. There we go, that scores in as well, thank you. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. Litwick's got an energy. Looks like, is he trying to draw for the Dusk Stone or is he just getting really unlucky? Oh, I suppose, yeah, Stella Wish. Ah, Red Candy, yeah. Okay, there we go. There it is. And the Jirachi has a skateboard, so naturally, back he goes, I imagine. Hey, Laura won. That's better. Where are we? There we go. Bam. That result is in. Okay, yep, that Spirit Burner knocked me out that time. See, that's why we have to be ready with something else. So Anka Anger does 90, 100, that's 120 damage, which isn't enough to beat Chandelure. So we could bring Venus or Snivy forward knowing that we can attach enough energy. Or we could bring Dalmise forward for Giga Hammer, but we can't use it next turn. So I think Venus or Snivy is the more sensible approach. Yeah. So we'll pop another energy on there like that. Do we want to switch? I do not think I do. I think we want to take the chandelier out and then we'll voltage beat for the extra two energy. Delmise is already ready to attack. So even, oh yeah, I suppose if Venus or Snivy gets knocked out, that's the last three prize cards he needs. But I suppose that's the risk I'm gonna take. Unless, I'll tell you what we'll do. Ordinary Rod. Two basic energy back into my deck. Shuffle that in. I'm going to Cynthia. If we get a big charm, we can just bump up. Oh, that's a shame. That would have been a good attach. Oh well. We'll 
bump away that giant hearth for a life forest. And we'll pop Shaman on the bench because he is a good boy. And that'll have to do. Let's go for a forest dump, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like Whimsicott won again. Wow. That, that that must have been a really cracking game. Wow, so I'm guessing guys that Alex won that over Stoic. No? Who won? I'll wait and find out in a minute. They'll tell me. They'll tell me. Oh, Alex won. Yeah. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Let's put that in. That that must have been a really awesome game. I wish I could have watched that. I think that's the only sucky thing is that you can't watch it on people's matches on TCGO unless there's something that I'm missing. <laughs> yeah, I imagine if people haven't eaten, they are pretty hungry by now. Alex is going to go get his tea unless he means his cup of tea, in which case, yes, also that. Deserve it. Looks like everyone's had some really close games in this last, like in this last round, which is pretty surprising. Oh God. So yeah, Matt's got me beat now. So I should have gone with the Delmise. I shouldn't have risked it with the tag team here and the three prizes because that Charizard is going to come and mess me up. Big style. Everyone's games seem to be wrapping up pretty quickly this time. So that's, uh, that's pretty crazy. So we're going to pop a win in there, because we got another result. Wow. There we go. Yeah, I lost again. I did make a mistake there. I should have gone with the Delmise, but I thought maybe I could, I could hack that out. Thanks for the game, Matt. I have learned, and I will not make that mistake against that deck again. Well done. GG. Dear. Cool. So let's switch back on this screen. Everyone can see the current state of affairs. We've got two games still ongoing. Again, if you guys haven't followed our Twitch channel, please do because all of our tournaments will be hosted here in the future and everybody will be able to see their pairings. Obviously, I'm going to get better as this as we go along. Thank you everyone so far. Um, it's been a pleasure. Oh, we've got another match incoming there. We've got a win here. There we go. I believe. And we've got one left. Um, so the standings so far, is this updated? No. So, yeah, we're just waiting on one last result. We've got Byron and Joe still going. But yeah, thank you again, everybody, so much. So much for supporting us. So much for playing. I will get your codes over to you in due time. We'll see how many... I'm going to owe people. <laughs> And I'll probably spend the rest of the evening, if not also tomorrow morning, giving everyone their stuff. So please, um, obviously, hang fire for that. And yeah, um, so it does look like we possibly have a clue. I don't know. Who has won yet? But yeah, and Joe has lost. So can everyone just really quickly confirm that those scores are right before I um scroll down? But I'm assuming it's probably just gonna throw these out at me straight away. Here we go. Yep. So 
Oh my goodness, what's going on? Oh, okay, so it is selling, telling me that I might be able to make edits. So here we go, so this is what this looks like. I can't seem to get absolutely everybody on the screen at one time. But here we are. So this is saying, wait, is that round four? Where is, what has gone on? What have I done? <laughs> um, round one, two, three, four, five. I oh, know five, here we go. Okay, so that's looking like, this is looking strange. So that doesn't quite look right because that looks like a four way tie, which is bizarre. So, yes, that's crazy. Yeah, same scores, same tiebreakers. Sorry. Yeah? Push off the Oh, okay. I see, so these guys have won the ties. So it's only a two way tie. Yeah between Stoke and Dale. So yeah, so actually, d for this tournament, it doesn't look like the buys have made too much of a difference. So we don't need to worry about that because it's not in our top cut. I will fix it for next time. Um, yeah. So that's brilliant. So congratulations, guys. I guess it's a two-way tie. I mean, would we, would we like to do I should be 4-1, Jack Fisher, 4-1, yeah. Yeah, 3-1 and then a bye. Oh, wait, no. So, yeah, the buys are coming up funny because I, I, they're coming up as... um. One point. No, wait, no, no points. Yeah, so the buys, the, yeah, the buys are coming up as one point. No, look. they're not coming up as any point. Well, it says buys one there, look. Uh, oh, is it, is it going wins, lost, draws? Wins, ties. Win, yes. Yeah, it looks like it looks like buys are going up just uh, yeah. at one point. But yeah, thank you very much, everybody. I will be getting yeah. Your standing wouldn't change, so it doesn't matter too much for this one. I will fix it for next time, so that a buy will come up as a win. I obviously missed that box somewhere when I was setting up the tournament, so that is entirely my bad. Um, we'll fix it for next time. Don't worry. Thank you, everyone, for playing. I will get your uh, prizes over to you guys. Um, so yeah, if you guys are able to. Um, if everyone's in the Discord, aren't they? So what I'll do is I'll message you each with your codes um, later on today or um, or tomorrow morning because, yeah. <laughs> so thank you, everybody that competed. That was amazing. Let's just scroll down so we can have a look at the rest of the results there before we end up today. But, yeah, that was awesome. Um, thank you for coming to our first one. There will be more. We're going to try a tournament every single Monday. That's going to be Monday at 7 every single week for £1 and we'll have prizes up until we run out. <laughs> um, but hopefully we'll be able to keep going um, because we'll be able to start doing some Rebel Clash prize packs eventually, which will be super exciting. So, yeah, cheers again, everybody. Have a lovely evening and we'll see you. On Wednesday, hopefully, we'll be able to manage a tournament. I will pop that out on the Discord and the Facebook in a minute. We'll get everything sorted. Um, yeah, again, um, so yeah, just a quick shout out to the Slowpoke Well YouTube channel as well, um, where Shay's going to have his deck profile up, So and his games will be up on his channel as well. So please go and have a looky on his as well, because that will be awesome. Yeah, again... Thank you so much, guys. Ben says, hashtag ban mill. It's, it's, it's never going to happen. Um, thank you so much. Hi, Kyle. Jack says hello to Kyle. There we go. Okay. Thank you, guys. Very good games. Lovely to see you all. And, um, yeah, I'll see you some of you Wednesday, hopefully. And that'll be it for now. Thank you so much. And, yeah, tune in again. Follow the Twitch channel and all that jazz. Thank you so much. Goodbye.